What's up, guys? So, yeah, guys, I am back. What is going on here? I am back. Where was I, you ask? Um, I was in the middle of moving. I was in the middle of moving. I had school stuff to do. Uh, just had a lot of stuff on my plate, you know, so I couldn't really do as much recording as I would like to so I do apologize for that But today we are playing the forest. There was an update recently um, We are on public alpha version version 0. Point, version 0. 0.10 so We're gonna get right into it guys. I feel if we hit load It's not gonna load because it normally doesn't load so we might have to start over for like I don't know, like the 20th time, but that's all right. Uh, so if we hit load, there's so much new stuff in this update, guys. That's why I wanted to get an episode of the forest out today, guys. So if I hit load, um, I don't think I'm going to go to where we last saved. I'm pretty sure we're going to spawn in the plane. One thing they did add to the plane is there's going to be more passengers. Yes, hopefully, yes. So apparently there's supposed to be more passengers in the plane. Uh, just to make it look a little bit more realistic, which kind of makes sense, you know. Uh, let me adjust my mic real quick. So, yeah, uh, we're going to go see that, hopefully, if it loads in the plane. Uh, I think they made the plane crash even more realistic than, the, uh, than before, which is really good. Um, but, yeah, you guys see my new beanie. I think that looks really cool. Representing Colorado, that's where I come from, by the way. If you guys did not know, um, if you guys are wondering, I don't smoke weed. There you go. Um... Because, you know, that stereotype is pretty uh, out there. So, <laughs> yeah, just letting you know. Um, loading on the plane? Yes. All right. Oh, yes. Yeah, look at that. Passengers. That guy's wearing a flower. What's it? A flowered uh, Hawaii shirt? Yeah, this is a lot more realistic. Let's see this. All right. So, the plane's a lot darker. There's my son. Am I wearing a different shirt than, than before? I believe so. Oh! And now we're crashing. Yeah, there we go. Always has to crash. <laughs> that guy is freaking out. Having a seizure. It's okay, bud. It's alright. I think my son's more common than the guy in front of him. Which is weird. <laughs> and there we go. We hit the grounds. We're taking off. We're not taking off. We're doing the opposite of taking off, actually. But there we go. We just crashed. Awesome. That was a lot more realistic, guys. That is cool. That is cool. So... There we go. Hey. Hey, you have my son. Is there any more passengers around here, or did we just take all of them? Yeah, we just took all of them, or they just took all of them. Okay. Oh, and you can see my plane axe a little bit. Yeah, you can see my plane axe just floating. <laughs> Alright, there we go. Taking off my son. Very mean. Very mean. Not what I wanted. So, let's see here. Get up. Ooh, I think they changed the animation for the hands. That is cool. Okay, let's, uh, before we get out of the plane, let's grab everything that we can on here. There we go, we got our pedometer, and what is it, P to close? There we go. So, grab them bottles. Is there anything else we need to grab in this area? No. Okay, now let's grab everything from the seats. And we want to get out of here as quick as possible, because I know my stuff, guys. The mutants will come and search the plane soon. So, let's hop out. There we go, we're hopping out, and let's quickly grab... This and that, and we'll be good. Oh, wait, 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 wait. We are very close to the beach. Now, I think there's a little rendering glitch for the distance, like a distance glitch. Um, or is that just me? I have no idea. Maybe I should look into that, because it is a little weird, a little funky. Huh. See the mountain? I don't think you can get to the mountain yet in this update, but I do believe that they said they will be able to make it so you can get to the mountain. Okay. So, let's look for... A good place to settle down on our in the meantime let's go and collect some sticks some rocks um, make sure the mutants don't come after us man it feels so good to get back into recording guys I've missed this so much um, if you guys were wondering where exactly I was was uh, I was was no exactly where I was um, I was on a class trip with a bunch of my schoolmates uh, we are going to a, an acting convention in Denver called Thescon, and ooh, two bodies right here. Let's go uh, break these up. So yeah, I was at an acting convention with some people in Denver, and it's called Thescon, uh, and it, I just had th such a blast. And one thing 
that uh, basically what you do there is there's these different workshops that you do. You just run around, you learn, ooh, very bright right there. <laughs> and you learn about just acting in general, acting, um, like improv and stuff like that. <clears throat> and yeah, it was just a load of fun. You went to see a bunch of Broadway uh, type of shows, a bunch of scenes. We saw La Miserée, which is actually a play. Whoa. It's a French uh, three-hour play that is nothing but singing. It's entirely singing, which is crazy to uh, get all those vocal points down and just memorizing all the lyrics for three hours. It is ridiculous, but it was very, very cool. Um, after the play, maybe we should chop a tree down, maybe? No, we need to get out of here. We need to not be in this position. So... Um, one thing, the second day I was there, I was there for three days, the second day I was there, um, I went and saw La Miserée at night, that was at like 8 o'clock, um, 8, 9, 10, 11, so at 11 o'clock, we had the dance, and I come from a small town, a small county, I am in a small county right now, and it was ridiculous how many people I saw there, um, it was at least our whole, my whole county inside a room. Oh, hey. Oh, hey. What do you want? Oh, you creepy girl. You creepy. Don't touch me. I'm going to go. I'm going to go. I don't want your number. Oh, more coming. I feel like I hear more. Hey, phone, you want to shut up, please? I'm trying to get a, get a girl's number. No, definitely not. Stay back. I got to play an axe. Is it just... Ooh, ooh, is it just you? <gasps> no, 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 back off, back off, back off. Oh, no, 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 block, 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 block. Stay there. If you try to attack me, you're dead. Oh, you're dead. You, okay, wait until she stops attacking. And, oh, no, 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 just kill her, just kill her, just kill her, just kill her, and break it up. Perfect, okay. We executed that perfectly, guys. Good deal. Okay, no more of that. I am pretty low on health. Very low on health, actually. Um, oh, dang it. We should have opened up a... Ooh, hello. Give me that armor. <laughs> we should have gotten... Um, we should have gotten some briefcases while we were still at the plane crash. That would have been pretty helpful if you guys asked me. So we're looking for hmm, a good spot to lay down. As you guys do remember last time... Last episode, we actually found a pretty wide open range area, kind of like this right here. Um, and when we started settling down, um, I don't know if it was like a glitch in the game or something like that, but we had so many mutants on us. It was ridiculous. Like, like how many what is it? Like 18? 18 in just that area? It was very unsafe. Kind of like this cliff right here. We don't want to, uh, we don't want to, ooh, maybe we should. Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Well, the mountain's right there. And I believe that the beach is on the other side of the mountain. So we're going to have to cut across the forest. Don't think I want to get into, I mean, go down the cliff area. So we're going to keep on going. Kill this guy. Give me your armor. What was I saying? Um, yes. So we watched La Miserée. We watched La Miserée, and it was 8 o'clock, and we're heading back to the dance. So after that, there was a dance that had um, more people in the room, in the ballroom, than in my whole county combined and more. There were so many people. It was all like scrunched up like this. You could, you just could not do anything. Well, I mean, you could do anything. It was like a party. It was a total rave. It was insane. And I was with my friends. Um, you guys are going to like this. So I was with my friends. Is there a mutant right there? And we're just having a good time. We're inside the crowd, just like going crazy. And then all of a sudden, I was like, hey, guys, lift me up. I want to crowd surf. And they picked me up, and I ended up crowd surfing for a good, like, minute or so before they disallowed it, and no one else could crowd surf. So I was the only one who crowd surfed, and I was so, so stoked about that because it was just so much fun to crowd surf. Oh god, is there millions over here? No, okay. But yeah, it was just a ton of fun to crowd surf. That is definitely a check off the bucket list right there. 
super, super fun. Just the whole thing was very, very fun. Obviously, I miss recording. I miss doing this because this is obviously as well so much fun. But, um, you know, I might as well. Hello, you're right there. I saw you. Don't think you can scare me. I'm going to back off later, girl. Um, just going to ignore you. Don't touch me. I'm going to go to the beach. If you want, you can come with me. There you go. Just come with me. Come with me. Oh, God. I don't think we're going in the right direction. I don't think so. Wait, where'd she go? Um, yeah, she's following me. Let's just go. She ain't gonna get me. She ain't gonna get me. Um, so if we head down here, so I believe, uh, I believe, 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 the beach is over there. Yes, okay. So let's just keep going that way. Oh, and we should be fine. We should be good. Um, she's still, okay, she's still following. I don't believe so. In that case, let's go check the book out. Let's go check the book and check out the new stuff that is going on. Let's see. Um, temporary shelter, small cabin. We could get a small cabin going this episode. Like, oh, I know I always say that, but this episode I seriously think we could. A tree house, an alpine tree house. Instead of, a, instead of stairs this time, guys, um, they accidentally, not accidentally, they actually implemented a rope. So now you climb the rope into the tree house, which is very good. Very efficient, actually. Oh, did I hear someone? Uh, no. Um, and I might get some noise in the background. Noise in the background, like that, just like that. Oh, hello, did not see you. Okay, hey. Um, another, is this the same girl? Probably not. Ooh, but there's rope in that village. We need to go grab it. Um, let's just make sure we, she doesn't attack us, and let's just go grab this rope. Because rope is very, very helpful. So let's go in here. Uh, grab the rope. Creepy noise is going on. Yeah, very creepy noises. But we need to get this rope. Can I grab the rope right here? No, I can't. Just check around. Because I believe this is the only place you can actually get rope besides on the boat and in caves. So, um, yeah. And I got one piece of rope. I think that should be good. So let's get out of here. Um, creepy noises and stuff like that. Very uncomfortable. Ooh, they definitely changed the water though, guys. That looks nice. They did a lot with the water. That is good. So, I don't know if it's going to turn nighttime or daytime soon. I mean, daytime? No, what? I don't think it's going to turn nighttime soon. It might, and hello. Let's crouch and see if we can sneak up on this girl. Maybe? Let's try. Go, 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 go. Go, 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 Nice, 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 nice. Go, go. Oh, quick, before she gets up. Good deal. Got her teeth. Awesome. Okay, so like a place like this is a perfect example. We do not want a place like this, an open area, because, one, it is right next to a village, and I can see a mutant over there. You guys probably can't. Very, very small mutant. So anyway, right next to a village, and it is very wide open, which means there is a bunch of places in which mutants can spawn, which is something we obviously don't want, is that? So we're going to have to find a spot that is has room for building, but not enough room for minions to spawn. And a good example of that would be the beach, because it is one-sided, and hey, we found the beach. Good job, guys. I'm proud of us. So let's kill this other guy. Give me some armor. Thank you. Open up that inventory. Give me that armor. Awesome. So, we got a lot of stuff so far. Um, rope, legs, soda. Could drink some soda. My energy is getting kind of low. Yeah, I'll go ahead and drink that. And, uh, yeah, there we go. You Look at that. Lizard armor. So, I, for I think it's one thing. If I press R, I was looking at the controls the other day. And if I press R, does it start raining? No. Okay. <laughs> just checking and if I press slash slash backslash yeah there you go so if you press black uh, black no if you press backslash you'll actually check out your arm so if I press it again you check out your arm which is pretty neat I didn't actually know that until a couple of minutes ago actually when I was checking out the controls so why did I say the other day if I was only checking it out a minute ago anyway um, the water is looking very nice in this update, guys. I don't know if it's just because I changed my graphic settings or something like that, but it is certainly looking very nice. 
Um, I know I said I would be doing co-op, guys. Um, it's just I haven't found anyone to do co-op with. Uh, cause I have no friends, so, um, yeah, I mean, um, I don't think there's as many people, at least that I know, that are as interested in the forest as I am, but, uh, it's a very fun game. If you guys, uh, are into YouTube and you guys want to play with me, I will gladly oblige that. So, ooh, that's new too. I got the leather armor on my pants as well. That's cool. And a beach towel on the beach, obviously, it's called a beach towel. Um, we got tents over there. Uh, should we stay in our regular spot? Regular? No, yeah, our regular. Should we stay in our regular spots? Um, that's what I would hope so. That's what I would guess. Real quick, we need to go build a fire um, and a shelter and just get this day over with. Um, I think we've been into this episode. We're probably 16 minutes into this episode, I'm guessing, probably. So if we go to our book, let's go to our fire. Um, there's a bonfire, which is very cool. I want to check that out next episode. Um, a fire pit, which is probably what we want. We want a fire pit. So let's get a fire pit and place it in the place that we normally place. Ha, <laughs> tongue twister. Place it in the place that we normally place. Ooh, that also is new. They added the rocks over here that kind of boards up the beach a little bit, as well as a water area right here. Now, is the yacht over here? No, I do not see the yacht. That is unfortunate. Oh, well. So, we got rocks. There we go. We got the sticks. All we need is the rocks now. So, let's go and collect some rocks, and we should be good. Um, one more thing that we should do, and I do want to check this out, actually. Um, if I go to a log cabin, I can actually place it up. Oh, my God. Whoo! That is so cool. You can place the log cabin super, super far up. That is insane. Oh my god. That is like bigger than a tree house, guys. <gasps> you could get a tree house and then connect the house to the house to the tree house. Oh, that's cool. Oh, I wonder if you could put a campfire inside the log cabin. Can you put it in the water? <gasps> you can put it in the water. Oh my god. We are going to have some fun with this. So, there's a mutant over there. Better avoid him. One more thing I want to do is I get let's get a hunting shelter going. Um, can I lift up the hunting shelter? No, I cannot. Oh well, unfortunate. Okay, so let's place the hunting shelter right here. Um, how much do I need? I need okay, so some rocks, some sticks, and some logs. Okay, so we're gonna top drop down, huh? Chop down two trees, I believe. Two trees? I think so. So chop down two trees. We should be good, and that's unfortunate. I think it's turning nighttime, so let's hurry up and do this. Um, sprinting seems faster, actually. It does. It does. So, oh, and I think they changed the log chopping animation as well, which is very cool. Um, they might have changed the chopping speed of the tree, because it seems faster. Um, I don't know if that's just me, but it does seem faster. So, there we go. Come on, let's get this chopped down. We can get it. We can get it. Oh, come on. Why is this taking so long? There we go. And boom. Oh, sick. They changed the sound of the tree falling. That is cool. Um, can I collect more logs than this? Oh, oh. Is this a glitch? Oh, please tell me this is a glitch. I can carry three logs. If I press E really fast, I can carry three logs. Please tell me this is a glitch. Let's just take them all over here and then let's drop them and see if we have three logs in the end. Because that would be really cool. Come on. Come on. Oh, this hurts my fingers. And drop. Oh, oh yes. That is what I call multitasking. Three logs, one hand. One hand? No. Yeah, three logs, one hand. Title of the video. Three logs, one hand. And there's a mutant right there. Is that a guy? Yeah, that's a guy. Let's, uh, let's attack you. No, get out of here. You don't belong here. This my beach. Done. Oh, no, I didn't chop him. Done. Awesome. That booty. <laughs> that is sick, guys. You can carry three logs. I did not know that was a glitch. I think I just discovered that. Uh, tutorials. Yes, tutorial of how to carry three logs. Okay, so let's chop down one more tree, and we should be good to go. Chop you down. There we go. Oh, also, we need, what does it say we need? We need one more stick, 
and a bunch of rocks. We do need rocks. Rocks are a very essential resource for getting a shelter started. I think that's so cool that you can raise shelters. It is just going to be so interesting what people will come up with. There we go. New tree falling sound effect. Give me it. And fall. Nice. Okay. Grab that. Grab that. And let's head over here. Ooh, that sun is bright and shiny. So, oh my god, I just love that glitch so much. Oh, ho, ho. come on, let's bring this log over here. How much is that? Uh, three, six. So we're going to get six, and then just pick up the last two, and we should be good to go. Drop you, build you, grab you, grab you. Okay, um, all that's left is rocks. So um, let's quickly go grab the rocks before we... Uh, uh, die from the mutants at night time. Oh, did I just kill something? Uh, I heard a squishing sound. Might have killed someone. Oh well. Uh, um, quickly, 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 quickly. We need to get some rocks. Uh, that's a pebble. That's a rock. Okay. Um, that's a rock over there. Spotted you. Ain't gonna get out of my mind. Out of my, out of my, out of my mind. So let's get more rock. Rock right there. Perfect. Three, so we need six, right? Six or seven, I believe. Grab you. Oh, it's a rock garden. Grab you, and grab you, and grab... Ooh, that sun is blinding. That sun is very blinding. Okay, uh, one more rock. Ow, that sun! Ooh, that sun is blinding. Okay, um... You know what? Uh, it's, it's fine, it's fine. Oh, one more rock, perfect. Okay. Ow! Ow, that sun is so blinding! Oh, oh, and it really like makes my screen dark. Ooh, yeah, that might be a problem. The sun is very blinding. Sunlight hurts my eyes. Oh, come on. Oh, we need one more log and one more stick. Okay. Ooh, game froze for a second. Okay. Um, yeah, one more log and one more stick. So let's grab the stick. Where would a stick be? If I was a stick, where would I be? Uh, it's a leaf, not a stick. So get over here. Get over here, um, pebble, human, oh, I can't see anything, we need to get the lighter out, there we go, oh, wait, 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 <gasps> oh, a walkie-talkie, press Q to communicate in multiplayer games, or is it a distraction advice, hmm, let's grab the plastic torch, because it's a lot more helpful, maybe, oh, no, that's not helpful, let's get the lighter out, lighter out is in a radius, and the torch is kind of, um, a direct, a direct pointer, you know what I mean? So, come on, all we need is one stick, and I really don't want to get caught by these mutants, so, one more stick, and we'll grab the log. That's a rock, I'll take the rock, actually. Um, stick, where are you? Come on, stick. Come on, stick. This is an episode where we look for a stick, come on. There we go, stick tree. Done. <laughs> okay, we got it. Let's get home, get rid of that lighter, and, oh, I can't run anymore, I'm completely out of energy, quick, drink a drink, drink a drink, okay, and go, 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 chop my way through, <gasps> oh, mutants, 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 I see that, that's a lot of mutants, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, quickly build this, build this, build this, build this, build, build, done, okay, um, first of all, C, save the game, we are good. Okay, good job, guys. C and then Z. Let's wake up. Wake up. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Three, six, counting. That is six mutants. Okay. Okay, guys. I think I'm going to end off the episode here. This is an episode that you definitely don't want to miss, guys, because it's in my new house, guys. You can see behind me, this is in my new house. Pretty cool. If you guys did enjoy this episode, give it a thumbs up. My name's Piano Thrower. I'll see you guys in the next episode. Money. See you later, guys.